Welcome back to School of Civil Engineering. This is Datullah with another new video. As we have started SAFE 2016 tutorial series and uh, in our previous lecture I have just uh, dif discussed about every basic of that software and uh, also we have a design slab. Also we have um, design slab from uh, ETFs to CSS SAFE. Okay and uh, from that lecture I am just going to show that how we will draw and design a slab with drop panel okay with drop panel so let's start and if you're new to our channel then watch our previous video that full playlist link are given in description and also if you're a civil engineer then they have many software related solution and also basic knowledge video that will be very helpful for you so subscribe to our channel and also stay with us so let's start first of all I will open our software I'm using CSSF 2016 and uh, if you need that software then uh, you can download that software also that uh, download link are given in description so first of all and um, before so uh, if you new to our channel then you know that uh, in our first video we have defined everything and we have saved our all file here to reduce our next tutorials time okay that's why uh, I will also make a copy of it and if you need here please uh, watch our previous video and so this is our source file just I'll paste it here and I'll give change it name slab with dp I mean drop panel okay slab with dp so we have uh, provided that name now I will just open our uh, SAP software so here our software I have opened and from here I will just go to our that document actually so this is in desktop okay and here uh, slab with drop panel so from here I will just uh, take our previous model actually here why, uh, why, why I am taking that model because uh, I have just mm, defined everything okay I have defined everything just see here I have defined everything in previous okay that's why I am just taking that model uh, otherwise if I mm, uh, define everything here uh, it will take huge time okay that's why I have defined everything S just uh, here in a previous video first of all I have different materials then slab properties then uh, beam properties okay then reinforcement bar size then uh, column properties then subsoil properties here our subsoil properties for mat foundation and for here for uh, I isolated uh, subsoil properties for isolated foundation okay this is for mat foundation this is for isolated foundation so first of all I'll just cancel that now uh, here I have defined everything just except I have to define a column with drop panel okay so for that I'll just go here column properties and here just see here here we have a uh, already defined column properties 12 inch inch into 12 inch column so if I go in modify just you can see here here 12 inch into 12 inch but I uh, I haven't uh, defined anything here uh, not on uh, not also the drop panel or drop column capitals actually what is the drop panel and column capital if I show you that just uh, see here here uh, this is the column capital actually this is the column capital and has the column and uh, here is the drop panel okay here is the drop panel we can use column copy capital or not but uh, in this lecture I'll just show that how we'll use a drop panel actually okay so I'll just close that so here actually flat slab design I will design a uh, flat slab okay so I will just uh, cancel that and from here I will make a copy copy of it so add a copy property so from here this is the column with drop panel okay so our column face will be same 12 inch into 12 inch okay now uh, here uh, our now we have to include here okay automatic drop panel dimension so I'll just select here include automatic drop panel over columns okay so I'll uh, give her the or uh, drop panel size I'll just give her drop panel size is uh, 
5 feet into 5 feet okay 5 feet sorry 5 feet means 60 inch into 60 inch 60 inch 16 inch into 16 inch so I'll just and from here obviously we have to select the drop panel but uh, we do not define any drop panel okay so we have to define first so I'll go back cancel cancel and first of all we'll go define then slab properties and from here we have to define a drop panel okay so I will just come here add new properties then D P okay so from here I will select the materials property this is uh, FC prime equal to 2880 then from here we'll select drop okay we'll select a drop and we'll give its thicknesses suppose 6 inch first of all we'll give 6 inch and if required we'll change its dimension in later so press ok so it is a drop panel then ok now we'll go for our uh, column properties so from here I'll just select copy of it so column with DP drop panel so from here it's uh, okay now uh, materials property are also okay now from here I will just come here and I will take 16 I mean 55 feet into 5 feet drop panel actually uh, I'll change that in future if required okay suppose um, if our drop panel fail to punching share check then we'll again come here and uh, change, change that so here is the DP okay this is our DP drop panel uh, slab properties is DP now here also we can include the column capitals so if you want to include column capital simply click here and here give the column capital height here is the height of column capital and this is the parallel to Z and parallel to X so here actually here it's represent the uh, the upper side of the column panel size and the lower of uh, I mean uh, the lower portion of column pan panel side, uh, side will be same as our column size okay so this is the upper size and this is the and this is the height okay what will be the height actually of our column capital so I'm not just uh, going to use column capital that's why I'm clicking here I mean untick here then press okay so we have uh, defined successfully then okay so we have defined everything actually okay we have defined everything so oh uh, here uh, it's done and in our next video i'll just show that how we'll uh, create our grid line according to plan and also how we'll uh, draw and uh, design our slab so if you think that that's helpful for you then don't forget to subscribe to our channel and also press the bell icon so that you get every update ever first and also like our video share our video and don't forget to leave a comment because your uh, own comment and your own opinion inspires for the next work. So thank you. Thank you very much. S12, stay connected till next video.